Hi, my name is Shin, and this is my wife, Fong Ha. We have been married for 27 years, and uh, we have got two sons, Samuel and Jeremy. Samuel is 24 years old, and Jeremy is 20 years old. I'm originally from Singapore, and Fong Ha is originally from Malaysia. Two and a half years ago, that is back in 2015, I realized that there was some weakness on my left leg. And initially, I just dismissed the symptom as old age. And, but later on, I realized that the symptoms is getting worse. My GP referred me to a neurologist. Uh, and when I see the neurologist in, in two weeks later, and uh, he conducted a series of tests, and after the test, he told me the bad news that I've got motor neuron disease. Motor neuron disease is a severely debilitating disorder that affects um, our motor system. It affects um, our everyday function like talking, eating, walking, and ultimately our breathing function. Motor neuron disease will affect your ability to live day to day. So if it starts with your limbs, it will affect the way you walk, affect the way you eat. But for some people, motor neuron disease starts affecting your breathing and your swallowing. And when that happens, it is dangerous because it affects your vital organs. And if you can't eat and you can't breathe, you will end up dying. I still remember when uh, the neurologist told me that I've got motor neuron disease. My whole world just crashed. It's as though an atomic bomb has actually been dropped. There's no cure, there's no treatment for it. And you have only got a short lifespan of two to five years. So fast forwarding from the time I first come in contact with motor neuron disease, we have very recently developed a model um, of the disease in, in animals and similar to the human condition our mice develop rapid motor loss and succumb to the disease but when we use the genetic trick to remove the pathogen that actually drives the neuronal dysfunction we not only could stop these mice from deteriorating further but to our surprise within a very short time of two weeks these mice recovered a significant amount of their function which really raises the hope for therapies not only to be able to at one day prevent the disease but actually recover lost functions. We live one day at a time. It has, knowing that he has got this chronic illness has actually made us live one day at a time not knowing whether next Christmas is going to be my last Christmas or do I have another five, ten Christmases to go. To love... To love your family and to love one another. So my message to everyone is that research is very time-consuming and costly. And I'm convinced that in the next five to ten years that we will reach a turning point in in making new discoveries in motor neuron disease. I love my wife, by the way. <laughs>